Hi, my name is Tony Allison, and uh, years ago I was instrumental. I was one of the few people that molded a plastic called Calif 81, which was used in uh, valves to um, some material that does not get brittle at absolute zero, and so it is used in uh, rocketry. And I helped NASA put two probes and send them to Jupiter with, with my uh, valve inserts in their valves. And uh, since then, well, all my life I've been interested in rocketry. And I still am, particularly in trying to determine what force is. And I am working on a lot of... Uh, hypotheses. Anyway, here is a, a rocket mold that I made years ago. I just went outside and got this out of a big box. I think I made 500 or so of these of kits. And they're, they're, they're rocket kits, but they're um, a complete kit. Each one of these, each one of these uh, complete kit. But, you know, some of the parts are missing because they've got knocked around and jostled around a little bit, so I have to go back and pick them up. But anyway, the kits had all the fins, had the nose cones, it had the um, bulkheads and uh, the uh, ejection charge um, tie-downs. It also had the fin, if you notice this here, Look real close. You can see the the um, the uh, what what um, the fin holders, the fin the fin guides, and uh, what else? Let's see. Well, they also came with um. They did not shown here. I don't know. They were at the end of the thing. But anyway, there was a uh, rocket uh, motor tubes too, included with this. So these are just drying out. I have washed them off and, and uh, rinsed them off, and they're drying. But I'm going to be using these in, in future tests um, to test different designs of rocket motors. And I hope that some of them will become fairly notable. Anyway, I thought maybe you guys would be interested in seeing this. So I'll just will end it now.